Commentator, also a fantastic player making it all the way here this deep in bracket. He's gonna be, ooh, he's actually playing the Bowser. Bowser versus, uh, versus, uh, oh my gosh, Ness. <laughs> I don't know why I was gonna call him PK Chris. But yeah, no, <laughs> Ness, like, same honestly, thing. Like, honestly, yeah, same exactly. Thing. But yeah, Bowser versus a Ness, a matchup you really don't see often. You don't even see Bowser in a lot of uh, competitive yeah. states uh, in, this, in this certain competition. <laughs> but, ooh, PK Chris, of course, taking up a lot of damage on Muno, but Muno just being like, oh, I'm gonna survive back to neutral. Because Bowser is yeah. so heavy, it's gonna be so difficult for Ness to even try to um, finish him mm. off. Okay, so a couple things worth noting. First of all, Ness has some of the best kill power, like, consistently in, mm -hmm. in the game, especially, like, from neutral. So even though Bowser is very heavy and loves surviving, it might be hard for him to do. That being said, oh, oh my god, that Koopa Claw almost killed at 70. That, that Koopa Claw gives you such anxiety whenever it happens. <gasps> that was so good. So right there, PK Chris is probably expecting a Flame Breath because that Flame Breath, uh, if he does the Psy Magnet, he will absorb it and heal mm -hmm. dump just a little bit. Uh, but, uh, Rain Man right now. What? He hit him? Nah. How? I swear Forward Air came out. I swear. That's what I, I thought. Saw I thought Fair came out. Was that like f frames before Forward Air connected? It had to oh, be. Okay. But Shadow Smash would be like, just you're funny. He taunted, baby. He taunted? No, you're funny. <gasps> Muno kind of crazy. <laughs> but again, Muno, Muno at about a 30% deficit uh, compared to PK Chris's 15%. And Muno just limps to me winging on the ledge. Both, oh, they're funny. Okay. No, no, us, this is, if you're PK Chris, this is the move. It's the, oh, no, you fool. If you jab, you get closer. Because mm -hmm. Bowser's jab moves him forward slightly. You absolute fool. Yeah, and with that right there, because PK Chris had the lead, that was just a statement. That was mm -hmm. the statement of, no, you have to approach. I will sit here on the other side of the stage if that's what it takes. And, I mean, it, 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 the instant that Munal approached, he got hit. So, it works. To be Ooh. fair, he was approaching by accident with that jab. <laughs> However, oh, I trying to punish... Uh, uh, PK Chris on the ledge, but it just simply would not work. And PK Chris trying to use that yo yo, but again, not quite close enough to the ledge to really edge guard uh, Bowser. Oh, but yeah. that one will! That damn yo yo. Good stuff to PK Chris, managing to close out that stock. He was kind of struggling up until that moment. Oh, but here's where things get so tricky. <sighs> He's having to no, get off the waiting. ledge. Ooh, big damage. Yep. Racking up a bunch of damage, punishing that recovery. I like that. I like the fact that PK Chris is throwing out a lot of moves uh, when he's at the ledge, specifically the bait. Oh, what are you doing here? Oh my god. You should be teching those. Come on. That was so much damage. That was 84 in the. That trade not really going to work See, out. Sometimes we don't tech those. Yeah. Well, sometimes you're like, you know, I haven't been in a combo video, and if I can't get a combo myself, <laughs> maybe I just let the other guy get the combo. Yeah, Muno is thriving right now in a really sour spot. That Ooh. being said, if he's able to survive, he's at 109, and Bowser is, you know, one of the best characters with rage, considering just how strong all of his moves are. <gasps> oh, but that parry is so good. It's not going to kill just not yet, but... Kill. That spacing. All right, and here's where the damage starts to come in. How much can Muno do with it? He's off stage. <gasps> does he have a jump is the question. He does. Beautiful job saving Please, that. I'm so glad he saved his jump. Always save your jumps, guys. Oh, 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 okay. What? what? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, PK Chris, if he gets Koopa Clawed here, I'm pretty sure he dies. Mm -hmm. He gets Koopa Clawed and... Uh, oh, man. But he won't. <laughs> yeah, the thing is, Ness is just so good at killing. They buffed his dash attack to kill, and it makes me question the uh, the ethics of the design team. No, there's, there's a lot of things that they buffed, even recently, that I was like, why did they buff this character? There was no need to. I, the, dash attack, to me, is like the most... Exactly. Like, for you. Yeah. The fact that he has... Look at the range on that move. Also, yeah, I want to see this first stock here, because he gets knocked off stage, and... Yeah, we can go sl slow mo actually. Wait, awesome. Let's go. Yeah, all right. Managed to go in here. So here comes this. And now. Maybe. Oh. I thought I saw it. 
you saw the very beginnings of forward mm -hmm. air, like the first few frames. That but that just came out first, yeah. yeah. By just literally by a few frames. It's just, it's just that, a few frames. I think frames. one frame. I genuinely. Literally. It's, I, we maybe could have counted it. Maybe it was like two frames. But still, nonetheless, uh, that's going to be PK Chris taking game one, but not necessarily that decisively. One Koopa Claw could have uh, mm -hmm. taken it from you now, but. And Munel was really waiting on, the, on that side, likely waiting to, to do that Koopa Claw, but. KK Chris, Ness. Oh, uh, all right. Oh, the classic Ness yo yo uh, ledge trap, but just simply would not work on Muno. But this might be it for Muno. Yep, uh, this is the first talk. What was that? PK Flash? What was that? That was absurd. Uh, he went for PK Flash to cover a jump out of the corner and it worked? PK Chris. All right, buddy. Absolutely insane with Ness. Yeah, I do like the fact that Munal has been consistently punishing the Psy Magnets. It's a really great movement option for Ness, generally speaking. And the fact that he's just shutting it down really effectively, you know, it's going to be, it might be a difference maker. I really agree. He might actually get another Koopa Claw. Just to, just to close out the stock a little bit. Yep, there it is. Good Goodbye. Call. Oh! He missed the platform. If he landed on that platform, PK Chris was absolutely done so. Mm -hmm. But uh, that means that he's surviving. He's planking at the ledge. Yeah, uh, but not, 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 not the fair. <laughs> Definitely not that. Oh, Perry's the first oh. in that neutral air, but not the you know consecutive hits right after. You know, not looking like he's in such a bad spot here. 77, 88%. But as Bowser, he's going to be living for quite a while longer. If he manages to get like two or three good hits in, once more Koopa Claw is going to be a threat. He really will be, and right now we have a PK Chris is probably like we we can do we can tell that Moonel is um is being very very cautious with his uh, with his spacing and making sure to really get away from PK Cloud PK uh, Fire PK Cloud like all those. Yeah, at the same time, I love this theme movement right now from PK Chris. The way that he's uh, oh for a second I didn't think he's gonna recover, but then that yo-yo just said ah watch this. <laughs> yeah, that was unfortunate. I don't mm -hmm. think he meant to go off stage right no, there. No, yeah. Cost him dearly. Well, oh, he messed it up. He got the footstool, but uh, didn't quite get the actual follow-up right there. Man, but PK Chris is, I mean, on a big body like Bowser, yeah, he, honestly, go for the style. Mm -hmm. He's a big hitbox. He's such a big character. Easy to really attack him. But he's, he makes up for that in strength. However, Are you kidding me? However, that was, oh my gosh. He just took <gasps> him. He just took him. He oh just, like, God. destroyed him. Hello? <laughs> PK Flash? What is this move? Look at that. Instant neutral air, down air. I think we saw the beginnings of forward air come out. Oh, man, when's when's the buff of... Uh, when are we going to buff Bowser forward air to have it come out quicker? Like, wait, let's see this. God, I think it was... Please, yeah. again, it's the same situation. It was situation. the exact same situation. This time, it was, it was going to take even longer for him to come out. Did he shift his hurt box into the down air? Look at this. Right here, would this down air have hit? I don't think it would have. But then as we advance frame by frame, he sticks he his claw out in order to re like wind the other one back. Mm -hmm. And that's the reason that the down air connected. If he had just like put down the controller, I don't think that would have hit him. Lily touched his claw and that was game. Yeah, and there it is. Who boy. Good stuff to PK Chris at the end of that. Just looking absolutely brutally dominant. Um, I think we're actually going to be doing a caster, caster swap, swap. Yep. right now. Uh, so, honestly, it's been a pleasure commentating for all of you. You can follow me on Twitter, at SaltyFun underscore SSB. Do you want to give your own oh, little yeah. plug right now? <laughs> yeah, hi, guys. So you can always always follow me on Monster Neva, uh, because there's an extra A in there, because the first one's taken. <laughs> <laughs> and they haven't used like 10 years, but it's okay. I'm not mad. No! <laughs> 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 this is so sad. <laughs> Must sniff and then just start screaming. No, but, but we're gonna do a caster stop. We'll see you guys next time. I've been Monsneva.